Hi, this is JP from California. I just wanted to go over how I use Craigslist in my real estate investing. I know a lot of real estate investors like to use Craigslist, but sometimes it gets to be a little bit of a pain going through all of the different cities and areas and then trying to, to narrow down on the keyword searches for all those different places. So one way that I like to do it is to set up an RSS feed so that I have those permanently set up and I can just read them in my RSS feeder. So what I'll do is I'll walk you through how I set it up on Craigslist and then we'll go over to Google Reader and I'll show you how it shows up there. So we go to craigslist.com as normal and select the area that we want to go to and I'll choose Atlanta here and we're going to go to real estate for sale and then in the search for box I'm going to put motivated seller. we can search all real estate or we could just do real estate by owner but for this one I'm gonna do all and then hit search and that's gonna give us all of the searches for the ads that have motivated seller listed in them somewhere and we've got 636 over the past couple of weeks or month or so and I'm gonna scroll down to the bottom here and right here in the bottom right corner you'll see RSS the orange RSS logo what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click on that, copy it, copy the link address, and then I'm going to go to Google Reader. Now you can get to Google Reader if you have a Gmail account, if you go up to the top, these links up at the top, you can just select Reader and it'll take you to it. You can also type in google.com slash reader and hit enter and it will take you to the Google Reader. You'll need to have a Google account, a Gmail account set up or just a regular Google account but once you get in here it's pretty simple. You go right here to add a description, click on that, and then I'm just gonna right click and paste and then select add. Once I do that the listings show up and right here you can see all of these listings. Now the great thing about this is this will continuously update so you'll always have the latest information. Yeah, it updates every five or ten minutes and you can actually force it to update by just hitting reload and it will update at that point. The other nice thing is as you read these the default setting is for it to disappear from your list so you don't have to see every single one. Right here it says show four new items all items. Well you can have it show only the new items and at that point you will only see the new stuff that you haven't seen or you can hit all items and it will show you everything. Now this is just a one-line list. Right up here at the top we have list and we have expanded. If we go to expanded, it's going to give us each of those ads in their entirety. And then if you wanted to go to that ad, you would just have to click on it and it would take you right to Craigslist and you could respond to the ad from within Craigslist. So if we go back to Google Reader, go back to list, as we go through this, it's going to mark all of these as being read. And you can set up as many of these as you'd like. So, you know, we could do motivated seller for all of the areas that we're interested in looking at. We could add any other types of keywords that we want to pull and pull them into our reader. And it makes it really easy to pay attention to what's going on in the markets that you want to look at. This is JP from California signing off. Hi, this is JP from California.